Let's head up to Scotland with Chris Stevens. Chris Stevens. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Uh, one of the uh, issues that's not, not stated uh, often enough is to thank the public sector workers who have gone the extra mile during COVID. I'm thinking particularly those processing furlough payments in HMRC and universal credit payments in DWP. And of course, as the Secretary of State will be aware, the heroic efforts of those who work in the National Health Service. So will the Secretary of State thank those public sector workers for everything they're doing? And can he explain to them why this government believes they should be subjected to a three-year pay freeze and whether he thinks that's appropriate? Um, Mr Speaker, I'd like to pay tribute to all those who have been working on the coronavirus response and more broadly uh, across the public and private sectors working together uh, to make this happen. Uh, there are clear, significant economic consequences of the actions that we've had to take and as a country we're going to have to get through those in the same way that as a country we've pulled together to get through this coronavirus crisis so far. We're not there yet but we're making significant progress.